good day to you. Yep, deep in the art of Texas. Sure is nice out. Nice little uh, 45 degrees. Love this weather. Well, I got an update for you. Hope you enjoy. So, my first video of my step van, I did a walk around. So, I didn't really uh, do much editing to it. I just walked around the, the step van and just kind of showed what it is that I got. I think I talked a little bit about the possibilities of what it could do, what my intentions for it are. And well, I just uh, walked around my step van just now. And uh, it's not finished by all means, but uh, I'll give you a little uh, update, sneak peek. Uh, show what's going on here. Well, if you watch the first video, you can see that the ceiling has changed. It used to be a bunch of uh, loop uh, pegboard with little bungee loops for holding tools. But I still have to do some different woodwork all up in the overhead area and still got to do a lot of work over here. So I haven't really done much there, but... Uh, I did do, I added a board and some insulation in between the door and the uh, door slide area. And then I still have some, uh, the sound mat to put up in here. I, uh, yeah, basically uh, insulated most of the back end, but bring you on up board to see. Got this little floor mat that I found for free. Fits pretty nicely. Needs to be clean. Need to take it to pressure wash it, you know. But later for that. Uh, see, I still got, I stained this red right here. Painted this right here. Still have this cover that goes over this thing that's got a to put on there uh i painted this a darker gray than it was like that silvery aluminum and that's a darker gray right there but uh i got boards that still need to go up right there little speaker box holder same on this side where the speaker box was got insulation I'm going to put the speaker box back there and then some other stuff there. But I put cedar planks. Oh, what do you see there? Oh, yeah. The wall used to be right behind the jump seat. You see the line right along here uh, where the wall used to be. Now there's like standing space or sitting space or little desk cubicle space right there. Put this uh, wall up here. I, I moved this outlet. It was on the other side of that wall and tan and I moved it around. I think I accidentally pushed a uh, the off button when I went to touch the screen, let's see. Uh, so what are they? Um, I've got these up here, cedar boards. They're all uh, waterproofed on both sides. These bolts in there. And you can notice uh, up close, 
This bolt head is different than this one because this one has, it's hard to get actually, but um, anyhow, it's got a magnet. Put these neodymium magnets, however you pronounce it, there. Uh, also relocated the electrical that was in here. Um, when it was a little closet, sort of closet, it was all confined inside of there. And when it was like on a wall here and attached to the metal grate, but there was a board in between that. So I, I moved all of it to right there. And, uh, you know, I still got to do stuff up there all along the dash. But let's see here. So, I built a door and a wall. I actually built the walls first using parts of the wood that was this wall uh, framed out a wall added this door handle right here some hinges and I still got to do a little bit of a touch up on here but uh, in some areas a little fine tuning you know but uh, yeah let me know what y'all think. Let me know if you want to see what's behind door number one. Or. What's behind door number two. Which way should we go? Two or one? Thank you for checking this out. Stay tuned.